Hey, this is Jeremy Frazy, FWM Community Connection, and I'm sitting here with today's community spotlight, Craig Diatley, who is the owner of Century 21 Empire Realty. So, Craig, appreciate you taking the time to Thanks, do an interview. Sure thing. Um, we've been doing these FWM Community Connections to really connect local business owners and really just get the word out um, through the community on what's going on in our community. Mm -hmm. So. Definitely um, looking forward to getting the word out with uh, what you do in Century 21. So, um, first question, I think this is vital. Why did you choose Portsmouth as your guys' location? Oh, absolutely. Uh, hands down, it boils down to one thing, and that is that is our community. You know, Portsmouth is the county seat for Scioto County. You know, I was born and raised out in the kind of Minford, Lucasville area. Spent a lot of time in Portsmouth, but, you know, volunteering uh, down here with Main Street Portsmouth. Uh, so it's a really important, uh, it's an important relationship. I call it a symbiotic relationship. The better Portsmouth, the city of Portsmouth is, the better all of the surrounding communities are. And, you know, I'm right in the heart of it all. And, you know, one of our missions in our company is to, give back as much as we can to the community. This is where I was born and raised. This is where I have my roots. And, uh, you know, we could have gone a lot of places and, and, and developed a successful company and maybe been a, a smaller fish in a bigger pond, but we love being here. We love the people that we work with each and every day. And this is our hometown. Yeah, that's awesome. Um, there's something about hometown and coming back and doing these things in your local community. Yeah. Because you're right, you could just be a number somewhere else, but um, when you have a business where you were born and raised, you know their names, you know their kids, you know grandparents. So there's something different when it comes to doing business in your, you know, your um, your hometown. Absolutely, it's added value. Yeah. You know, one is you can have a successful business all over the place, but when we're operating here, we have added value to the community. We can give back, whether it's those high school uh, kids that are you know running for River Days and and uh, Homecoming Queen and the local sports, being involved with the local youth programs and uh, all sorts of things. The nonprofits in our community that are working so hard to make our community better for those uh, folks who live here. Those are the things that we like to be involved in, and, and so it's added value. You know, you can run a successful business all over the place, uh, but here we feel like we, we were able to give back. Yeah, no doubt, no doubt. Well, we, can, we definitely appreciate all that you guys mm -hmm. do. Um, obviously, us being out in Medford, uh, there's nothing like seeing on Saturdays all the little kids running out, you know, playing baseball, and there's yeah, you know, your name soccer, on the back. <laughs> Benny basketball, the whole, the whole thing, we yeah. love it. All right, so that takes me to the next question. Um, with real estate, there's a lot of misconceptions with our area, with real estate in general, um, you know, that this is a bad area to be buying or selling properties, mm -hmm. whether it's for residential, you know, commercial. Um, there's just that stigma, and I think a lot of it's just not the community not having the facts mm -hmm. in regards to what's really going on in our community. So if you can share some light on the truth with uh, real estate, That'd be awesome. Absolutely. So the one thing that you hear people talk about all the time is just, you know, houses are not moving, you know, houses are not moving. Or I get the question, what, you know, what's the real estate market like? And, uh, you know, the truth is people are buying and selling houses every single day, all year long, whether you're in Portsmouth, Minford, Wheelersburg, Columbus, all these places, folks are always buying and selling real estate. And these are the, the, largest transactions that oftentimes people make and some of the biggest investments that they make in their entire lives. It's a very important job because we help people achieve their strategy when it comes to real estate. So, you know, residential real estate, folks are looking at, at their houses, where they're going to live, they might be moving up, they might be moving down, but it's happening all the time. And as you've heard recently, some of our housing numbers are up in several of our communities in the area uh, for various reasons, but it's one of the exciting things about um, my job is looking at these statistics, uh, seeing that the city of Portsmouth is up nearly 20% over the 26, 2015 numbers. So, you know, things are growing and when houses, you know, houses go on the market and they sell in, in a week, you know, those are the stories we hear about from other communities and people need to realize that that happens here. 
uh, with residential real estate. Mm -hmm. A couple of the, the other things that are important is, you know, in downtown Portsmouth, there is a significant amount of activity happening. Folks purchasing buildings, um, expanding their businesses, and even more looking for properties to either relocate, expand, invest. And uh, that's one of the real encouraging things. Back to that idea that the better the city of Portsmouth is, the better Minford, Wheelersburg, Lucasville, Rosemount, all these other places are. Mm -hmm. uh, so real estate is happening in Scioto County. It's happening a lot. And it's so exciting to be part of that. Uh, don't let people fool you. You may miss out on that good deal with this preconceived notion that things are just not going to sell because they sell and sometimes sell fast. Awesome. Good info. Um, so, kind of talked about why Portsmouth and then the misconceptions in regards to real estate in general in our, in our mm -hmm. area. Now, why Century 21? What makes, um, what's the value add for you in Century 21? Because obviously you, you could have um, picked a long time ago to be independent, do your own thing. But tell us a little bit about Century 21 and the, and the value add that they bring. Well, hands down, when you work with Century 21, you've got a team. We've got a team of agents that all work closely together. They uh, enjoy working together, being in the same office. We're always talking about you know things that are going on, what folks are looking for, uh, working to get properties sold, finding properties for buyers. You got that team, and and not only that team of agents and uh, folks working in the office. But we also have the partnership with Century 21, who works hard as the most recognized brand in the world to bring the best tools to our fingertips. So oftentimes, you know, it, we would never be able to afford to bring these tools to the table for you, the buyers or sellers in the area. But because of our affiliation with Century 21, leading edge technology, leading edge tools, things that give you a... a you know, a leg up on the competition just simply by that affiliation. So we've got the team of folks in the office, we've got our partnership with Century 21, and we're always looking to be one, you know, ahead of the game in technology. Just like the, the new camera that we bought recently to give you a three-dimensional walkthrough of the property. And I don't know how many times I talk to people, they're not even necessarily looking to buy a house and they're online touring these properties just because it's cool. They, yeah. they they think that, man, I really like that walkthrough. I looked inside that one. And and it's so interesting to hear that. So, you know, that's one of the tools that we bring to the table to help, plus all the marketing that Century 21 has. It's worldwide reach. You know, offices all across the country, all across, across the globe, and they're all under the same... Uh, smarter, bolder, faster, that's their mo mantra, and that's what they're working for. That's where the technology comes into play uh, because they're giving agents the tools that they need to be as successful as they possibly can be. That's awesome. Well, if you're looking to either buy, sell, um, even, I guess, lease a property when it comes to residential or commercial, how can they get a hold of you to schedule an appointment? Sure. Uh, give us a call at the office, 740-354-2112. Uh, you can check us out online at century21empirerealty.com. You may think that you don't have a need for real estate, but I guarantee you everyone has a next move in real estate, and uh, you just got to figure out what yours is and give us a call. That sounds good, Craig. Well, again, this is Jeremy Frazee, FWM Community Connection, and uh, we want to thank you for taking the time to watch, uh, watch them today. So you have a great day. Thanks, Jeremy. All right.